And the only time it penalizes you for getting Pokemon knocked out is if all of your Pokemon are knocked out. Because then, cause then you're torn limb from limb with something you protect. <laughs> Pretty much. Is the uh -oh. effect of that cumulative? He's doing it multiple times. Yeah, yeah, is that cumulative? yeah it is cumulative. Oh, I got a critical hit. Ooh, nice. Oh, he's doing it again! Yep. No, sometimes they'll they'll just like, they'll do it like three, four turns, and then they'll one shot you. It's kind of nasty. Didn't pay off for there. Alright, let me Nope. Up. Death makes me stronger. <laughs> Your resistance only makes me grow faster. Ugh. <laughs> oh, now I'm making him fight his own kind. Oh god, I think you're kind of uh, at a mismatch there. Oh, Jesus. Does that consume my turn to switch like that? Okay, yeah, it does. Yes, yes it does. Now, like, when you're in a trainer battle, and you knock out one of their Pokemon, it'll say, like, they're gonna use such and such next, do you want to switch? And if you switch right then, it doesn't, it doesn't take a turn. Oh, okay, so then, like, if you want to, like, change a guy who has, like, the, like an right. appropriate elemental affinity that would be more effective. Right. Alright, okay. Oh. Okay, now Jade has Tim with him. His start with Tim with him. This Pidgey's already busted. Oh god. A little bit. Man, you suck, Jade. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna make it through another one. No! <laughs> oh Jesus. Beetle back. Let's put Jay Beetle back in. Maybe he can score another kill. Well, I mean, you don't you don't have to do that. You could actually use your Bulbasaur instead, and he would still get XP from the battle. Oh, does everyone get experience? Yeah. Oh, everybody I didn't know that. Th everybody that participates in the battle gets experience. Oh, okay, is it equally distributed? Um, for the most part, yeah. Okay. okay. So even if, if if you have like a really weak Pokemon, something you can do is like put them in your first slot, and then as soon as as soon as the battle starts, switch them out, and they'll still get half the experience from that battle. Okay. They bring you to level five. Sand attack. Which does nothing but lower accuracy. <laughs> what? Just like they're just being pelted with sand, I guess. Yeah, pretty much. You know, pocket sand. Makes sense. Like after attack him with a belt, attack, Sander. Just like, sha, sha, sha. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. Can you heal your Pokemon back to perfect health? Alright, All right, yeah, put him in the tanning bed there. Fully restored. Now, now the Pokemon cartoon, that's... Doesn't that have... Is that... How long did that run? Is it still running? For a it's while? still going. Yeah. So it's been going for a really long time. Oh, I have only over 3,000 Pokemon Land, Pokeland fun bugs there. Yep. I think I'll pick up a few items here. It's not a bad idea. Yeah, you definitely don't want that many. <laughs> now, what's the show about? I mean, I mean, I mean, Pokemon, obviously, but like, uh, who are the characters? Well, there, there's the one recurring character, and that's Ash. He's the he's the main character of all of them. Okay. Like, it does it does different uh, seasons, I guess you could call it, mm -hmm. for each new generation of Pokemon games that comes out. Like, you know, introducing the new Pokemon, things like that. Okay. Yeah, but Ash is the main character in all of them. And he's like a young Pokemon trainer or something? Yep, and it's crazy because like, he never gets older. It's like he's the same age now that he was when the when the show first started. Oh, there's a, oh I actually have a reflection. That's neat. That's a nice little touch. 
So okay, character main character is not a vampire confirmed. Nope. <laughs> I go shopping in Pewter City occasionally. I have to take the winding trail in Viridian Forest, Mike. Oh, the old man get up now? Well, now I've had my coffee, and that's what I need to get going. What is that red box you have? Ah, so you're working on your Pokédex. Let me give you a word of advice. Whenever you catch a Pokémon, the Pokédex automatically updates its data. You don't know how to catch it? Wasn't this Pokédex, like, just invented by the professor? Though? Yeah, pretty much. So it's kind of odd that everybody knows about it, but... News, uh... news travels fast. You don't know how to catch a Pokémon. I suppose I'd better show you then. Oh, no, no, the old man's attacking me! Help! <laughs> Wild Weedle appeared. What will the old man do? Okay, so now, okay, so if you didn't know how to use the Pokeballs, right? This is the, this is the explanation. Yep. I do wish though that it could tell when you've already caught some of your own. Be like, oh, okay, you already know how to catch them. Gotcha. Weedle was caught. <laughs> Tonight we eat like kings. <laughs> There, now tell me, that was educational, was it not? And here, take this, too. Tamed the Teachy TV. Can't watch that. Teach you about the basics of being a pro. Oh, okay, so it's like a little, like, uh, more like tutorial stuff. Yep, pretty much. This tree looks like it can be cut down. I assume that's like some sort of item. That lets you no, do that. um, there's actually, there's actually moves that you can get via things called, uh, TMs or technical machines or, uh, hidden machines, HMs. And um, HMs are ones that you can actually use outside of battle, like cut. Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool. That's good. Okay. Yep, there's a cut, there's surf, which lets you, you know, travel across the water on the back of your Pokemon. Uh, there's fly, which, you know, you can pretty much use as a fast travel. Neat. And then there's there's other ones like a uh, strength that lets you you know push rocks out of your way and stuff like that. So Viridian Jim's doors are locked. Denied. You forgot to talk to that guy. <laughs> let's see here now. This Pokemon Jim is always closed. I wonder who the leader is. Pretty crappy one if the gym's never open. Yeah. Say. Bring your tips. Okay. Okay, I noticed there's like two, there's like this route, and there's this other one route there that had a much higher number. Oh. Yes, that's because you can't really, like, that progress was... on that until much later in the game. That's right, two, and this is route. What was it? Route 22. Yeah. I still yeah, so that, that's a there. That's a late game route. That they have it right there. It's a trap for the unwary. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm sure that somewhere someone has just like relentlessly grinded in that first area until they could actually make it through there with them or something somehow. <laughs> Route two, Viridian well, I City mean, to Pewter City. I mean, because of uh, because of like the hidden machines that you don't have yet, you wouldn't be able to actually make it very far through that area. Oh, okay. You need like okay. Yeah. Terrain obstacles and such. Right. It's on. Pidgey, we meet again. Go, J. Beetle. Our Pidgey is much more aggressive than his, apparently. He's got his hand up like that. He's his wing up like that. I didn't like... know birds had hands. <laughs> Although the way he's holding it, it kind of looks like he's like ra like he's raising his hand in a class or something. Oh, missed. Kinda. Oh, he's just hit. so eager. He's like, "Hey, pick me." Victory. Yeah, you definitely want to get your uh, get your Raditz some experience too. It's only level three right now. Okay, yeah, let's let's do that. Let's... Like I said, even if you have to, you know, just put her in the first slot and then switch her out as soon as the battle starts. Yeah, 
I don't think Jade's gonna live long enough to take this thing down. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you can get another, you can get another hit in, but yeah, yeah you'll definitely swim, want to switch. Swim Go for it, Jay Beetle! Nice. Victory! Okay, so it's split between them. Nice. Exactly. What's this? That is a whole nother route to go someplace else. Tata may be small, but don't underestimate its wicked bite. You caught one already? Yes. Are you going to Viridian Forest? It's a natural maze in there. Be careful you don't get lost. Uh oh. Yep. Also be careful you don't get killed. <laughs> Viridian Forest. I came here with some friends to catch us some bug Pokemon. They're all itching to get into some Pokemon battles. Trainer tips. Weaken Pokemon before attempting capture. When healthy, they may escape. Gotta cripple them first. You have to establish dominance. Prove you're the alpha Pokemon. <laughs> Before they... Whoa! Wild Caterpie appeared. So Go. that's the non-poisonous -po one. Jade! Guns here. String shot. All that does is lower your speed a little bit, so you know, no big deal. Now, what does that affect? Like your hit chance? Or... No, no, just your your turn order. Sometimes if they lower your speed enough. Okay. Again. And those are cumulative, you said. The demons. Yep, they do stack. Brink of death. Yep. Might be a good idea to catch him. Ah, uh, you only have one Pokeball left after this. Could buy, I could go back and buy more. That may not be a bad idea. I, mean, I could use the healing have... anyway. Yeah, exactly. I was just about to mention that. It's covered with a green skin. When it grows, it sheds the skin, covers itself with silk, and becomes a cocoon. Worm Pokemon. Even though it's definitely a caterpillar. Six point four. <laughs> no, that caterpillar weighs six point four pounds. Yep. Look at him. He's a meaty-looking caterpillar. The captured caterpillar. Oh, this one's actually a sheep. Yep. You want one name for you? Sure, why not? <laughs> All right. Do you want do, do, you, do you want your do you want one do you want the name one name for you to be a caterpillar or? Uh, well, it'll eventually be a butterfly. So. Wait, you do know about evolution, right? I know that it's a thing. I don't really know much about it. Oh, okay. We can discuss. Yeah, we can discuss it as soon as we finish this. That's cool. All right. Yeah, I know that like they can. I know, I know that Pokemon can like evolve into other types. I mean, I guess it, I mean I guess it makes sense. Like a caterpillar Pokemon could evolve into butterflies. Yep. It's kind of bizarre because the other caterpillar actually evolves into a bee. <laughs> That's strange. <laughs> like a, gi a gigantic bee. Wild Weedle appeared. Oh hey, that's the one. 